Well, welcome back to Discipleship Pathway. Today, we are taking some of the final steps through this process uh, to living life on mission and really being integrated into our community, building relationships and sharing the love of Jesus with our neighbors. Missional communities is what we're talking about today. And if you haven't watched the previous videos, please go back and watch. They build off of one another. And that leads us to missional communities. Uh, this can uh, be such a, an ambiguous term, uh, but essentially what it means is, is we've gotten a group of people together who are meeting on a regular basis and we have community together. You might be at the point where you are doing a discovery Bible study. You may be getting together and playing board games twice a month. Uh, you might be uh, a part of a group of people who has the same routine meeting at the dog park. Or maybe you're in an online community, a Facebook group for instance, uh, that has a, a common shared interest uh, and you are starting to, to get familiar with the names that are popping up in your group chat notifications. So missional communities can, can vary from, uh, from place to place, from person to person. There's so many different expressions of what a missional community is. But essentially, this is the point where, where we've built off of everything that we've learned so far in Discipleship Pathway. This is the place that we're trying to get to, a missional community where we are invested in the lives of these people. We know their names. We know their stories. We've had meaningful conversations. We've been able to, to be open about the fact that we're Christians and have some spiritual conversation. And this is now becoming our village that we are uh, doing life with. We, we are supported by them. We are supporting them. Uh, each and every member of the missional community uh, bring something to the table, uh, again, with our blessed rhythms, with serving, uh, serving this community and allowing them to serve us in return. And so there's still no agenda here. We're not trying to evangelize. We're not trying to uh, convert people, but we're trying to have open and honest conversations about uh, our lives, where we're at, uh, the things that we're struggling with. Uh, and then, like we said, uh, with our blessed rhythms in the last S story, connecting uh, their story to God's story, sharing our testimony, our story of how God has worked in our lives. So missional communities can be uh, this really big and ambiguous idea, but it's actually very simple. It's just a group of people who care about each other. And uh, us as, uh, as Christians and, and our people of, of peace uh, going into these communities and saying, hey, we want to make an active effort, not just to tell you that Jesus loves you, but show you that Jesus loves you.